oh, here we go. You're in your game um, on the mound and you are doing your new windup. Um, obviously, we've adjusted this since our last lesson um, to give you a better presentation to this. But let's take a look here at, at it, okay? So half speed here. Boom. Look at that really good K position here. What I would kind of like to see is this arm is a little bit too bent. Um, it's okay to have like a natural bend here, but we want it a little bit straighter. Um, so let's work on that. Okay. Just a little bit straighter as we improve our arm speed. Um, this will probably happen naturally. Okay. So moving forward, boom. Now this is the thing that we have talked about a lot and we're, it's just this pressure right here, okay? We want you to be a little bit taller in your posture, right? Shoulders back, we talk about pulling your hips forward. The way that we're gonna do that is we're gonna get this foot to pull forward here more. And then, okay, so drag having a stronger drag towards home plate or towards your front foot. And then also we want this leg, your front leg here to be, and honestly the arrow should probably go the other way. We want this leg to be a little bit more locked out. Okay. Not completely stiff, but we want, we need it to help support our drag leg. So with a little bit of strength and a lot of practice, we will get there. This one is from the front side from your tournament. This is actually the angle that um, I actually love to watch because I can see so much more of your body. So first off, I do want to say like great presentation and just step onto the mound. We'll watch this just a little bit in between your pitches. Okay, there you go. Okay, boom, you set your you set your right foot. I love that. But set the right foot. Set your back foot right there. What a great presentation and way to start. From this position here, you're ready. You're ready to go. Yes, you are, and you're ready to like fire that ball in there. Boom, ball presented at the top of your head. I love this. I know we've since changed this, but getting your arms up high is super important so that you can create momentum. We're gonna find ways to keep keep this part of your pitching um, in your motion. You extend, okay, let's stop right there because this is super important and I wanna show you this because you gotta remember the things you're doing good, but look at your arms. See how close they are to your body? There's not a lot of space in between. That's really good. One thing that I do notice that we kind of maybe might, might want to look at here, and this is kind of a girl thing, but see how your knees are kind of turning in? Both your knees are turning in. We want to keep our knees um, pointing straight, okay? We don't want to be knock kneed or having them point in, okay? This can affect our lunge when we stride out. So let's just, not a major issue here, but something that we'll just keep an eye on at moving forward. Boom, look at that right there. Strong front side here. Okay, so you're really getting landed. Your arm back here is in a really good position. That's all really good. And I do wanna point out right here that you still have pretty decent posture. But as we've talked about, we need to improve our posture at the end. And in order to do that, we need to focus on this piece right here, your back foot, okay? As my back foot, but most importantly, my back toe. When my back toe starts to drag forward from here to connect, that's when my front knee can kind of start to straight, straighten out a little bit and I can develop a little bit of strength and then my posture will continue. But you'll see here as we move forward, boom, you kind of will go back just a little bit, right? I'm gonna go back, right there. See, see how your foot kind of jets out? We wanna bring that toe 
more towards this way, okay? When your foot jets out, you try to step forward a little bit too early and then your posture starts to break down. We need you to bring those legs, those beautiful shoulders, that nice tall body with you straight at the mound and you will have an incredible pitch. Bay, you're doing a great job right now. Don't let anyone tell you any different and I can tell that you've been practicing a lot at home. That is a major key to our success and for you growing as a pitcher. And yes, anything is possible and anything can happen. So keep practicing hard and can't wait to see you this week or next week or whenever our next lesson is because we're going to keep growing and keep glowing.